Hey guys, Kate here, Utah Trikes. Welcome to the shop. Today we've got a fun project to share with you and that is a special, special quad build based on the full suspension Cat Trike Dumont. This one's for you, Swamp Rat. That's his YouTube handle. So what is the deal with quads and why do we build so many of them? Well, we've been building quads and converting trikes to quads since we first started. As a matter of fact, Utah trikes was almost Utah quads. Here's a look at some of the earlier quads that we've made. While a four-wheeled quad is going to be a bit heavier than a three-wheel trike, quads appeal to a lot of people because of the increased cargo capacity and the two-wheel drive traction. For off-road riding, it's easier to straddle objects with a quad than it is with a trike. And of course, a big part of the quad's appeal is that they look more familiar to people. With big wheels, they look like an ATV or a small car. And while recumbent tadpole trikes are generally very stable, more wheels means more stability. We built our first cat trike based quad prototypes in 2010 using the villager as the base and perfected the rear end over the next year. In 2012, we premiered the first production cat trike quad conversion at the cat trike rally in Florida, where Paolo Camazme told us that we ought to call it the cat four. So we did because when the founder of cat trike gives you a good idea, you take that good idea and you run with it. In 2014, we announced the Fat Cat 4, still built using the Cat Trike Villager frame, but now equipped with big fat 26 by 4 inch tires. With its higher ground clearance, lightweight aluminum frame, and more upright seat, the Villager is appealing to lots of riders. It's a bit wider as well, which pairs well with the fat tires. We don't only use the Villager though, we've had customers in the past who enjoy the more laid back seat of the Expedition, which features Cat Trike's patented aluminum space frame design. The Expedition frame is a bit more narrow and is a little closer to the ground than the Villager, but it works incredibly well as a quad with standard tires or big fat tires. Now, in the last few years, we have seen an explosion of trikes featuring front and rear suspension, and people have been asking for a Cat 4 based on the now discontinued Road AR and the Cat Trike Dumont. Converting the rear suspension on a trike over to a quad does present some challenges so that it'll still handle great. Well, when the Swamp Rat told us that's what he wanted, we said all right, and we made it happen. He's getting the UT Custom Cat 4 Dumont Fat Quad. The Cat Trike Dumont was introduced in 2015 as Cat Trike's first full suspension folding trike. If you want to know more, we recently filmed a comprehensive review of the Dumont. You can check it out by clicking the link at the top of the screen or by following the link in the description below. The Dumont uses Cat Trike's patented front suspension with 12 millimeters of travel. In the rear, you'll find a RockShox Monarch air shock that can be adjusted for rider weight and comfort. The Monarch boasts an impressive two inches of travel. Because of all the custom work this quad required, we had it built up by Luke and Ben down in the machine shop. The 
Dumont uses a single pivot swing arm and while beefy, it's not designed to handle the extra lateral strain of our quad rear end. We needed to stiffen up the frame and eliminate any side to side sway while still allowing the up and down suspension to work. To make that happen, we used carbon fiber tubing and mounted it so that it ran from our custom quad rear end to the lower seat support. We had to make our own mounts, which was a process all its own. Luke designed a mount in SolidWorks and then 3D printed a carbon fiber prototype to make sure it fit. Afterwards, we machined out the same part in the mill and powder coated it in a nice satin black. With the carbon fiber tubing, the Dumont does lose its folding capability, but really there are no quads that fold. Yet, maybe we should look into that. We've configured this Dumont quad with the 20 by four inch V Apache slick tires for some intense road riding. It sits low to the ground and floats like a butterfly over the pavement. This one features a nine speed pinion drive, which we've talked about in previous videos, and it's paired with a 10 speed cassette in the back. It also has a SRAM GX trigger shifter instead of the standard bar end shifter you find on most cat trikes. After the build was all finished, Ethan took it out for a test ride cue footage you have to admit guys this thing looks so cool All of our quads feature our UT Custom Posi differential that allows both wheels to spin independently of each other. Our differential uses a free wheel for each axle, making our differential serviceable and capable of handling those big wheels and motors. The differential helps eliminate tire scrub for those of you riding on the road and keeps your tires from slipping over wet grass, loose dirt, or snow when you're off-roading. You're like, wait, off-roading? With racing slicks? No way, but yes, there is a way. For those of you wanting to do some off-roading like the Swamp Rat, who is the soon-to-be owner of this quad, we can swap out those slicks for bigger, knobbier, 26-inch fat tires. Hey, it's Lewis. I was just looking through this order and they're supposed to have 26-inch tires. Okay, Lewis. I'm Lewis, so put them on now or else. Okay. Once Justin got the wheels swapped out and the cargo rack installed, it was time for some more test riding. This Dumont Fat Quad really is one of a kind and we loved building it. We especially enjoyed taking it out for test rides. We hope you all enjoyed this quad as much as we did. Swamp Rat, dude, we're stoked to ship this thing out to you so you can start tearing up the trails with it. Or maybe you'll throw the slick tires on it. Or maybe both if you want. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to our channel, turn on the notifications so you can catch our newest videos. Give us a thumbs up and enjoy some more riding shots of this full suspension quad monster.
Writing, writing, writing. Hello. Hello. That was a good one. See ya. Did you catch the, did you catch the sports ball game? Sports ball? Yeah, sports ball. Yeah, always. Did you? Never miss. Wouldn't want to be ya. Unless you have a quad, then I would want to be you because those things are cool. Maybe we'll catch the next sports ball game. Hopefully. I hope so. Always do. Yeah. Gonna crush your head, Dylan. Trikes. Three tires. Quad. Boom. Four tires. I wanna start over. <laughs> <laughs>